for it TV. The world is thinking. So what's, what's the purpose of the water then? Why do we have so much water in us? Well, all of the chemical reactions that take place in our bodies take place essentially in solution, in water. Okay? And this is the key thing. This is why we need the water in us to allow chemical reactions to take place. Now, I have a chemical reaction here, which is, which is rather an unusual one, because it's actually a reaction between two solids. Okay, I have two colourless solids here. One is lead nitrate, and the other one is potassium iodide. So they both appear white, but if I shake them up... Now, this, this usually takes... A, it's much quicker in the UK for some reason. I have no idea why. <laughs> This must be Australian lead nitrate or something. I'm don't know. <laughs> okay, but there we are. We see the colour is changing. It's uh, not not. Let me try a bit harder. It doesn't need this much effort, I can assure you. Normally, yes, right. Uh, but anyway, it's gone uh, a yellow colour now. I hope you can see that there is a yellow colour there. Now that's actually very unusual to see this chemical reaction taking place between two solids. If we do this in solution, so I have exactly the same reagents here, lead nitrate and potassium iodide, mixing these together in solution, we instantly get this yellow colour, and the yellow colour is due to the formation of lead iodide. So essentially the two halves of the reagents swap over. Okay, reaction much quicker then in solution. 